So here's my Duojiao Yu Tou, um, steamed fish with uh, fermented chopped chili. Cooking up. Hi, this is Cooking Aba. As you can see from here, I bought one very beautiful uh, snapper. It's actually, I bought a whole fish, so this is half of the head. This is uh, very fresh and uh, very nice. Uh, looks gorgeous. Okay, after cleaning it, I have actually sprinkled some salt on top. And uh, now let's, uh, before steaming the thing, the fish here, let's do, let's uh, do some arrangement. At the bottom, I put some uh, spring onion you can also put uh, ginger if you want okay we just want to raise the raise the fit the fish so that it can be steamed more evenly and also the green onion is going to help to uh, re remove some of the fish fishiness okay and we put our fish on top of it Okay, so I'm going to steam this fish using the chopped fermented chili. Uh, in Chinese, it's called Duo Jiao. Okay, it is uh, naturally fermented and uh, with uh, with uh, rice wine, salt, and uh, sugar. Okay, so I can actually. So this is going to be a very very appetizing dish because uh, the chili here is not too spicy. Uh, it is it actually gives it some uh, very sourish nature sourish flavor. Yeah, because it's fermented. I'm just going to use it all finish off. Of course, you notice just now I made few slits on the body, yeah, so that it can get cooked easier and let the flavor goes in. Right. I bought this from a local uh, mainland China supermarket. You can't really get it in normal uh, supermarket here. Okay, and. To give it another layer of flavor, these are some blended ginger. So there, is, there will be a combination of flavor here. It's going to be very nice. Of course, at the end, I'll be garnishing it with some uh, fresh coriander, but that's later. Before that, let's give it some uh, oil. I'm using my uh, leftover garlic oil. I need trying to uh, finish it off because I made some new uh, new batch of garlic oil today. Or you can just use normal vegetable oil. Okay, we can probably give it a little bit more oil. And let's do some, give it some seasoning, just a little bit more salt on top. A bit of light soy sauce. And some broth. I'm using chicken stock here. Okay, and I will add some sprinkle some 
green onion right now and this some at the at the end also all right so we're going to steam our fish head as you can see from here i have one pot of boiling water and we can slowly put in our fish head Okay, can you see clearly? Let's close the heat and I tune down my fire a little bit to medium high and I'm going to steam it for minimum 8 minutes. This fish head is actually very thick. Minimum 8 minutes, okay? So we will come back shortly. Alright, because of the thickness of the fish today, I decided to give it another 2 more minutes. So it's total about 10, 10 minutes. Look at my new beautiful fish here. Uh, how do you know whether the fish is, uh, the snapper here is cooked? You uh, use a chopstick, uh, pour inside the, the thickest portion of the meat and you put the tips in between your uh, upper lips and the nose. Is it hot or not? It is, it is warm or hot, then it is cooked already. Okay, so I'm going to uh, Remove it from the steamer. It's now definitely cooked. Let's remove it from the steamer. Right, I'm going to sprinkle some spring onion and uh, fresh coriander on top. Alright, so here's my steamed fish with uh, fermented chopped chili. Okay? So if you like my video, do share my video to your Facebook, on your to your friends. Come to uh, Cooking Up Our Facebook fan page, you click above the like and follow button. Follow up on Instagram and subscribe to Cooking Up Our YouTube channel. Bye bye!